The city of New Hope has undergone quite a change in the last decade. The first high V in the Twin Cities went up where an old Kmart store used to be. Construction on a new city hall is underway and with the new growth, of course, there is an increased budget next year too. There are two city council members running unopposed for re-election and today we'll let you hear from them. They are John Elder and Jonathan London. Hello, my name is John Elder and I'm on the New Hope City Council. I've lived in New Hope for over 30 years along with my wife and we have raised our three children here. I've been a soccer coach, a scout leader, and a police officer in this community. I'm a regional coordinator at a church in town and I'm also on the board of directors for the West Metro Fire Department and the Seven Dreams Foundation for our schools. I'm committed to this community as a citizen and as an elected official. As a councilman, I serve on the Watershed Management District have been a member of the Beyond the Yellow Ribbon Campaign Board of Directors and a founding board member for the New Hope Community Farmers Market. This city has benefited greatly from a strong leadership that you've elected. We have seen strong growth in both housing and commercial redevelopment in our city. As you can see, I've worked hard for the citizens of New Hope. I'm asking for your vote in November to allow me to continue this service to you. Hello, I'm Jonathan London. I am running for re-election to the New Hope City Council. I have been honored to serve the residents of New Hope for the last four years. I have resided in New Hope since 1976 and have witnessed many changes to the city. New Hope was in its prime in the 1970s and 80s. Then in the 1990s and 2000s, parts of the city diminished. I chose to run in 2014 to restore the city's vitality. Today, we are making progress with new single family housing and business redevelopment. Some of my future goals are fiscal responsibility, proactive ordinance enforcement, effective and accountable public safety, and continued housing and business redevelopment. I look forward to my next term serving the citizens of New Hope, and I ask for your vote on November 6th. Thank you.